us rest in peace. Magnesites, Magnesites, Magnesites. I forgot that I needed to do a video about this. Should The Undertaker wrestle again? And my answer is yes and no. If he does wrestle again, he should have one last match. And that match should be against Brock Lesnar for the World Heavyweight Title. <laughs> That's what it should be for. I had heard before that there was a speculation of rumors that after Brock Lesnar beat him, you know, Brock will go on this, you know, tirade of destruction, rampage, just the, you know, immovable object and the unstoppable force all at the same time. And then the Undertaker would boom, come back, challenge him for the title, beat him at this year's WrestleMania, and then retire and go into the Hall of Fame next year. I think that that's the absolute best way to do it. I do not want him to wrestle Bray Wyatt and then retire, or Bray Wyatt and then Sting next year. The steam, the awe, the epicness of The Undertaker at WrestleMania, all of that energy was stamped out. F5 out by Brock Lesnar breaking the streak. That's what he had. It was his. The most popular streak of all time with Goldberg coming in an extreme close second. The Undertaker's unbeatable at WrestleMania. It took all of it away. What they call it, the stigma? It just took it away. It's gone now. For him to wrestle Bray Wyatt is like him starting over again. It's like, why? What epicness can the... Now, the WWE creative heads, a lot of times they think of things that I never could think of, and they just think of things to wow me again. Um, but I just don't think that it can be done with them losing. And then I'm hearing rumors that it was actually a mistake that, you know, um, The Undertaker got a concussion early in the match, so that's why he they decided to lose, and then Brock pinned him, but he wasn't supposed to pin him. It was like two different rumors that I had read about. Like, like it was just, I don't know. But the point is, it's gone. The streak is gone now, man. The streak, is, and like I said, to make it right. Like, for example... If The Undertaker came back, scared the fuck out of Brock Lesnar, you know, you, you know, Brock's just on a rampage, you know what I'm saying? Like, even if he goes against Roman Reigns this year, which I don't want to see still yet, I'm not convinced, but say Brock goes again, he beats Roman Reigns, say that or something. If he resigns, you know, I'd be cool for him to go through another, you know, year of destruction, but we see him more, and then The Undertaker just be like, yo, look, you know, boom, Brock Lesnar, last year, you took my streak, this year, yeah, yeah, hold on, he wears the hood, this year, I'm going to take your soul, and that's it, you know what I'm saying, actually, that needs to be done this year. Not next year. Needs to be done this year. And then that's when he takes the title. He gives it up. You know, he retires. He's on top. That shit is over. I can't see it being right any other way. Bray Wyatt is a great foe for him. But it's just, you know, storyline-wise, he's a great foe for him. But right now, it's just like me. <laughs> Look, you should have had him do fight Bray Wyatt last year then. You know what I mean? 
then then Brock Lesnar this year, Brock, Brock beats him, and then he comes back to reclaim and take Brock Lesnar's soul. Then we never see. Then then Brock signs with UFC, so we don't see him again. You know what I mean? Like that type of thing. That'd be pre- pre- uh, shit. I just tied that up nice and neat, put it in the box. You know what I mean? Ship it out. I just tied that up nice and neat. But we gotta go with whatever it is they're doing. Um, I love the Undertaker. Seems has lost an extreme amount of weight. Something happened to him a few years ago, and I know a lot of people were speculating whether he was sick. You know, like, did he shave his hair? You know, did he lose his hair? Did he have cancer? Was he undergoing chemo? Because at one point, I mean, that man was a six foot 11, 300 pound savage beast. And then at one point, it was like, whoa, what the fuck happened to him? What happened to his weight? Something's not right. But anyway, Undertaker, I love you. I just hope you go out the right way. Um, if I had to truly pick, I, I would have him wrestle again, but it would have to be against Lesnar and him getting his win back in some, in a fashion that would be totally taking his pride back. And even though he lost, it would just, it would just cement him. It just would make everything right. Um, if he's not going against Lesnar, I would say no, but. Looks like he probably is, so post your comments below. Let me know what you think, all right? Hit the like button right now. Yeah, hurry up and do it right now because I got a limousine outside, full ladies Wait for me to go, woo! One million subscribers, woo! You may now subscribe.